I mean, I have some weirdness that is like a little bit like mantis, but yeah, I have like a, a side like Paris, of course, that people maybe don't know. The world's coming after you. His fate is written. Shall we write yours too? There's a line in the movie where Tom shouts at you when like things are really getting wild. You'll figure it out, you know? And so I wonder when you're in the midst of the madness internally, are you screaming at yourself, you'll figure it out? That's the mantra for Mission Impossible. <laughs> we'll figure it out. You right. know, we get to a point where thinking about the next scene and that like McHugh and Tom love to work together and, and kind of like feel it as they go. Mm -hmm. So often things will come up at the last minute and I'll say to McHugh, hey, listen, what happens in the scene after this? And he's like, I don't know, we'll figure it out. And we always do. And I, you know, watching the movie, you just think, yep, they figured it out. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's hilarious. I have a theory. In real life, Pom, you are like Tom Cruise, the female version. Because looking at your Instagram, <laughs> it's motorcycle work, it's skydiving, it's all of that stuff. I'm like, yeah, she fits. Oh, yeah. I mean, she is he and he is she. I mean, he inspired me a lot. So there's like some things that I picked up uh, in, because I was in, inspired by him, you know, mm -hmm. the skydiving, for example. It, uh, I never did it before, and then I was inspired by him jumping all the time while shooting the movie. I was like, oh, can I jump with you? I was like, no, you need to get your license. Mm -hmm. So when I wrapped the movie, he gifted me the teaching of um, learning how to skydive, and he found a teacher for me. I learned, and then we did some jumps together. It was fabulous. Tarzan told me that, too, that, you know, he kind of said, mentioned to him, oh, yeah, that sounds cool, and then Oh, yeah, that's all. Tom just sort of goes like that. Yeah, 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 I mean, that's he's amazing. very generous. Was your first jump with Tom, then? No, I had to learn with, uh, with uh, an instructor. You know, mm -hmm. it takes some time. It takes approximately, like, 10 days, you have to have good weather, and you have to be in the classroom, and then jump, and you know, you, le you learn by doing it, basically. Where did you guys jump together? It was in California. In the sky. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> in the <laughs> sky. <laughs> in the sky. Yeah. <laughs> that has to be a bonding experience in itself. It was incredible. It blows I mean, my mind yeah. when I see your Instagrams and you're just like dancing in the sky. It's just like, I know, I just, I don't It's have so that freeing. You guys should do it. You look it's amazing. Just... <laughs> you recently talked about like the access that comes with hanging with Tom Cruise, whether yeah. it's swimming with sharks or yeah. flying in a helicopter. <laughs> Tell us about that and why are those like only experiences that you can have hanging with that guy? It's funny, I mean, isn't it? Sometimes we... he gave us a ride home with a helicopter, which yeah, is yeah. insane and so kind. And we all sort of joke about, yeah, this was a Tom Cruise day today because, <laughs> you know, well, his life is extraordinary, obviously, and, and that's the way he lives, and sometimes you'll remind him and say, you know, this is kind of crazy. And yeah. I'll go, oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, sort of, <laughs> he agrees with you. Yeah, it catches up with him. <laughs> but it's what he's used to, and obviously, he can make things happen. So it, it, we were somewhere shooting, and, and we talked about, you know, going in a shark thing, and he was like, okay, let's do that this afternoon then. <laughs> next thing we know, we're like eye to eye with a, a giant shark. Yo, that's why. that's wild. Yeah. That's yeah. just, yeah. that's pretty cool. You have a fight scene, the hallway fight. Yeah. Going one-on-one -on -one with Tom in that narrow hallway, was that like a highlight for you? And when you watch it back, were you like, holy cow, that was pretty. Oh yeah, I mean, it was like so, so many months of training. Now my only problem is like, after doing a fight scene with Tom Cruise, like how can I beat that, you know? It's like, it's <laughs> It's, it's so hard, you know? Yeah. And you kick a lot of behind in that, for, for sure. John Hamm told me a little bit ago that Tom Cruise is a movie star with a capital M and a capital S. Yeah. What is it that exudes movie star about him? I think he's, the, he's literally the last of his kind in that regard. In, in, a, in the tradition of the 20th century movie star, you know, he's never done television. He's only ever done movies. It, there's something classic about who he is and the way he conducts himself. He's worked with all the greats, back to Paul Newman and, you know, all those, uh, those actors from that era that he mm -hmm. acted with as well. Yeah, and there's like an elegance about him too, mm -hmm. you know? And a mystery too that mm -hmm. is pretty rare nowadays, mm -hmm. you know? I always say he always makes you feel like you're the only person in the room. Mm -hmm. True. When yeah. he's to speaking to mm -hmm. you. That's like, that's a skill and an art. And it can be anyone. It could be someone that he just like meets like that, that is introduced to him or, you know, that is not in the industry, you know, so. Yeah. I've known, it's been 17 years and if I, if I get a text from him, I still go to my wife. Look at that look. If anything happens to them, there's no place that I won't go to kill you. That 
It's written. What do you think that something Palm brought to this franchise? And then what is something that Simon maybe have told you about joining the Mission franchise? It was so great, this, you know, because we had a whole bunch of uh, new cast members uh, and we were all thrown together at the beginning and we, we stayed in Norway, we stayed in Italy together and we just kind of like, you know, didn't we? We sort of became immediately this little title yeah, group. We clicked yeah. immediately with Simon. So yeah, it was, in, yeah, it was wonderful. But um, yeah, I saw the movie the other night as well and I, I just love you know, you couldn't get further from Mantis in Paris, yes. you know? I mean, <laughs> yes. she's, she's such an incredible character, such a force, you know? And it, particularly in the, there's a fantastic chase scene in Rome. Uh, oh man, mm -hmm. you're so ace in that. She's just sort of, I mean, terrifying. <laughs> Terrifying. You, you can't take your eyes like I am in real life. You can't take your eyes off you in this she movie. She is actually terrifying. You really can't life. take your eyes off you in this movie. Yeah. Now talk about me. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, I will talk about you. No, Simon has some incredible moments in the movie, and he's able to bring so much emotion and so much comedy at the same time. Yeah. All right, stop. And no, it's not <laughs> no, keep going. <laughs> no, it's, it's so good. I mean, I was like a fan of Simon before uh, joining the franchise, of course, and we got to spend so much time together and you know was really lucky to have him part of the cast literally you know Paris is the complete opposite of mm -hmm. Mantis in so many ways how was that just being able to kind of shed that skin oh and God, do something like, completely different? it's like everything that I wanted to do yeah. to, to kick ass to to be insane and to just like turn it up you know and be wild you know is that a dream like being in a mission <laughs> franchise <laughs> I'm she is more like Paris than Mantis to be fair. Yeah, yeah I believe that I mean, I have some weirdness that is like a little bit like Mantis, so sometimes I have like no filter, and I'm like, oh, what did I say that? Like you know? Just say on the <laughs> it's all yes, good. like exactly. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I have like a, a side like Paris, of course, that people maybe don't know. It's, it was a little wild when I was watching it too because I was like, does she ever even speak in the film? Like, does she have a line? I think maybe you have like four lines, yeah. so impactful, but really don't speak. Yeah, and we were talking about that with Christopher McQuarrie too. He's this character is just a fighter. She doesn't need to speak, but when she speaks, everyone listens. Yeah. So that was very interesting to, uh, um, you know, to develop this character and to 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 work with the body language and with just speaking with your eyes. Mm -hmm. And um, oh, baby, you say a lot. With your eyes. <laughs> yeah. It's so powerful. She said, it's great. We were joking. We would joke about it when we were shooting. Like Pom would come in for get shooting for twelve hours and say, "I didn't say anything today." <laughs> but then you watch the movie and her. Presence, you know, it, and, and like you say, when you do speak, it's like, you know, mm -hmm. it's just great. I love it. You know, there are certain movie theme music that makes you like, Huh. This Mission Impossible is definitely one. Yeah. When you hear that music, does it still kind of do a little something to you? Oh, I'm 100%, right? Oh, yeah. yeah, I mean, I hum it sometimes. I, I would hum it right before a take just to remind myself <laughs> when I'm shooting the movie. I love just like, it. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's go. <laughs> and I was like, okay, I'm going to run on top of the, of the train. So I would like hum the music before. I seem to remember still going, pom, 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 yes, pom, pom. They pom. would do that. And Tom, <laughs> no, would, sing, really? Tom would sing it too with yeah, my yeah. name. I'm like, yeah, I guess I was like, that's when I pitched them, should we rename the movie Mission Impossible? There you go! <laughs> yes! yes. Uh, what do you think about that? No? <laughs> and on that note, what do you do? You don't have to do anything else. I know. Bum, 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 bum. Weirdly, they didn't Great. agree. I just don't know why. <laughs>